So once again, I didn't really get away without having some kind of makeup done and they used their new eyeshadow cheek duo, which is Tangelo. So it's obviously this tangerine orangey color. That's what the lovely Catrice did on my eyes right here. And she used Ginger Snap as well and Noir on the outer corner. I was also seeing the four lipsticks that they're bringing out next month so those are like really fun bright colors there's one deep plummy gray called london fog that i'm really interested in yeah, it was a really nice event really nice catching up with the ladies again i'm just going to eat some west indian food and then i'm going to watch walking dead <laughs> what a combination and i'm gonna go to bed because it's it's getting quite late now it's been quite a long day Good morning, um, I'm running late. I feel like I'm always running late for things, but like I'm not running f late to the event. Basically I'm going to an event today <laughs> and I'm not running late to that, but I really need to get my nails done. I don't know, I'm all over the place. I couldn't find the lid to my perfume. I just found it in my drawer, just as I opened my drawer, but I'm also missing the lid to this perfume. I've been having a look in the drawer, I can't see it. And I did tidy up here, so I don't know if I dropped it on the floor. But let's wear this. I did my hair and I mixed two things. I mixed, I put curl formers in and I used a, uh, a setting foam. And then I used this, which is like a finishing oil so that you know it wouldn't frizz up and every everything whilst I was separating it I wish I hadn't done that like the smell combination I don't know what the heck like this smells really nice on its own so does the setting lotion or the wrapping foam oh my god I kid you not it stinks like fish it doesn't anymore it seems to have set but like settled down but I was like hang on a minute all of a sudden I can have smell this like terrible smell and I think it's because I've like the scents have like mixed together and they don't go together so that's a shame because both of the products work really well and they work well together but they do not mix well in terms of scents at all I'm going to get my nails done I had wanted to get my eyebrows done but that's not going to happen and then I'm going to a blogging event with a few girls which is just so nice like there's nothing better to, than to find other people that do what you do or, and enjoy what you do and like you can learn from each other and I think that's one of the main things of the reasons that I started blogging is like finding like-minded people and potentially building friendships and relationships that way which is really really nice so that's where I'm going to take you guys with me today so I thought I'd show you what I'm wearing just this polo from Topshop my jeans are also if it wants to actually focus today thank you um my jeans are also from top shop they're the orson step hem jeans so you can see why it's recalled that and then my boots are from river island these little sock boots but you can get them literally everywhere this coat is from zara it's really old but lovely and my bag is ruby rocks so i'm an idiot i'm not getting my nails done um today uh, because it's just too much of a wait. Thankfully, I literally live within walking distance of everything. Oh, this is how I frustrate myself, because I just, like I do plan it properly, but I just don't, I don't know, I just don't get going in enough times. So I'm back at home now, feeling sorry for myself. And I think, you know, I was going, I had a red lip on, I don't know if I already said that, but I had a red lip on and I took it off because I was like, oh, it's going to be too much. But actually, I've decided you only live once and where, when else am I actually going to wear this red lip? Like, when else? So, I'm just wiping off this eyeliner because 
it's the Teddy Eyeliner by MAC, which is this really nice pearlescent true brown, but it's coming across a little bit black, which is not what I would like. Screw it, let's go for it. So, it is the Cat Fight lipstick from Fashion Fair. So, so pretty on the mirror. Look at that. Real bright red. And of course, I'm going to finish it off with the soft matte lip cream, or the lip teaser. Yeah, matte lip cream in the same shade. So, I'm going to lotion my hands because they are dry. Just wondering whether I should bring a scarf, but there's no point in being cold, is there? There's nothing worse than being cold, so I'll probably head off now. <laughs> After all that, I'm bloody early, <laughs> but might as well go in instead of staying out in the cold. Bridget's Bakery for tea and chatter. Oh. back home now my lipstick has fully disintegrated but it's because I had such a tasty little afternoon tea so that was with the blogging gals which is obviously a blogging community for us gals and they basically offer tips on starting a blog promoting your blog or just certain things about the blogging world that you wouldn't know on face value so they really really offer support and building the community in that sense always so nice to find like-minded people especially like-minded women obviously relate to them more and just talking about things that we love which is obviously blogging and oh my goodness look at this massive hamper that I've come away with it was sitting on a chair and I was just like oh I didn't even know I didn't say anything like terrible me obviously afterwards I was like thank you and everything but I, I just wasn't expecting so I was just kind of like putting it off of the chair but I was like is this for me so let's go through what's in the little hamper this is what I'm most excited about because if you know me I love popcorn and so this is the Tyrell's posh corn in Bellini cocktail chatty pillow no idea what this is not getting enough attention from your partner. Make them jealous by cuddling up to one of our saucy, <laughs> saucy uh, pillow characters. So I've obviously got this dream boat here with the sassy moustache little goatee as well. <laughs> Amard tea. Strawberry and basil. Oh, thank God for this. I always need something a little bit savoury after I've had something sweet. So more Tyrell's hand cooked English crisps, three bird roast, yeah now it's focused, Union hand roasted coffee and it's a really good thing because I just bought a cafetiere like because my uh, family has coffee farms in Jamaica, obviously went home with loads of coffee but I had no cafetiere which I now have so this will come in handy. Wow, we have been truly spoiled. L'Oreal Pure Clay Detox Mask, L'Oreal Cream Mousse for Curls, hey <laughs> Stronghold, Makeup Brush from Spectrum, La Moda, I love La Moda, so it's another one of those string chokers, I have one already but the one I have is gold so this has got silver ends so that's really cool, Oh, I think I'll take these with me tomorrow, Elizabeth Shaw Mint Crisps, 
This is 226 Nymphia. Oh, it's by L'Oreal again. That's a fun colour. L'Oreal L Net Spray, which I will probably use tonight actually because I'm going to put my hair into Bantu Knots again to preserve my curls. So I'll just probably spray it down with that to make sure it holds throughout the weekend. So necessary. Cold seam against common colds. Definitely the right time of year for this. Colour Reach Nude Gold. I've seen this absolutely everywhere and I've always been intrigued. So it looks like this. This light is terrible. It's not really doing it justice. There's little like flecks of gold in there. Oh, beautiful. True Brit Nail Enamel. So it's a nail polish. Let's see what colour that is. Oh, that is beautiful. That is beautiful. What's that called? Bulldog. That is perfect. The L'Oreal True Match Highlight. Oh my gosh, I wanted to try. Wow, we've really been just spoiled to death. Oh my gosh. There we go. It's a lot like the um, NYX uh, Illuminating Creams, I believe. So I'm really excited to try that out. I have the black ones of these. So Invisibobbles, three of those in a really fun pink colour. So that's really fun to try. I have the black ones and they are really good. I have another True Brit Nail Enamel. I'm already a big fan. Let's see what colour this one is. Beautiful. So this one's more of a pop of colour. It's like a coral colour. And this one is called Covent Garden. Covent Garden. Brilliant. That's just where I was. Covent Garden. So that's a beautiful colour. What an amazing event. I'll of course, leave blogging gals information down below. If you are a blogger or you've been thinking about starting a blog, it's a really great community to help you get started. Blown away, amazing, really amazing evening. So I'm really pleased. I'm just gonna have some soup to warm me up and go to bed. So I'll see you tomorrow. We are on the road. I skipped past everything. We're on the road. There's Lexi Bear. If you haven't known, Alex is my boyfriend if you are new to my channel at all. And I did get my nails done, thank goodness. I went for the same color as before, which is China Glaze. What's she dune, like sand dune. So it's a nice kind of icy grayish. So we're just gonna pick up another friend of mine and then we're gonna head down to Kent. Um, we're going to the Ashford International Hotel for a spa weekend. So I'm picking up a friend and we'll go down there, meet my other friend whose birthday it is or celebrations, her family and some more friends. And I'm just looking forward to it. It's gonna be a really good weekend. So after that like two hour journey, we are finally here and it's raining, but yeah, let's go in. Get our rooms. Me and Els, I'm with Els. Do you want to be on the vlog? Yeah. <laughs> this is Els. This is one of my oldest friends. So we're joining the party crew. We were just talking about how we're meant to get champagne on arrival, but it's a bit late. So we don't even know if we're going to get any, but yeah, let's get inside. Oh, this is nice. Oh, look at our little bed. This is our room. Next weekend. I like our little chairs as well. This is really nice. Ooh, little beverage. Sassy. Excuse me. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to have a nice bubble bath. I want to have a nice bubble bath. But it's really, really nice. Hi. Alex and I are just heading out to the pool and hot tub. So we'll just have a quick little dip. Sorry, I was way close to you. Oh, <laughs> have a quick little dip good. before dinner. We are back from the spa. We just went to like the wellness area. So the jacuzzi, sauna, steam room. Oh my God. So 
Went for a dip in the pool, which is nice. It was like tepid water, so it wasn't boiling hot, but it was nice and cool. Then we went into the sauna, which was also just really nice, because usually when I go into the sauna, my nostrils are like burning. Like, But that was just really nice and relaxing, like meant to be detoxing all that. And of course, utilized the hot tub and had that pummel me, like ma massage my back and my legs. So that was really nice. But then we went into the steam room on suggestion of um, my friend's cousin, was like, go in the steam room. My nostrils were on fire. I couldn't, we, we were in there for like maybe 30 seconds. Uh, two minutes, two minutes. Honestly, like a touch. I, I walked in and I was standing there and I was kept saying, I, I can't do this guys, I can't do it. Like immediate sweat. It is definitely good for a detox, but I definitely felt a little bit dehydrated coming out of it. And anyway, so this is Q, it's a Q Hotels uh, chain. So they use the S-Bar products. So I have been right cheeky. In this hand here, I just took loads of pumps of the tester. This is the cleanser, one of the cleansing balms. I'm gonna try that because we know I love cream cleansers. And then on the back of my hand, one of their firming brightening masks. So I'm just gonna wash my face with that and put on a mask using this. And yeah, we're just gonna have a shower and get ready for dinner. You'll probably, the next scene will be just my plate of food. Another one of my long-time friends. Eleanor, turn around. Yeah, I've already put L's on this. Yes, yeah, sorry. I've had enough of you. I've had enough of Eleanor. Thank you. Okay, Eleanor, turn around. My turn. All of this is gonna be. Hello. Oh, for a minute I was like, right, quiet, quiet. I was like, be quiet, everyone. What's that? I was like, as a nice neighbour. Save. I was like, shh, shh. I was like, I'm not with them. I was pretending. <laughs> right, I'll see you guys in a bit. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ciao. 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 I would mean you, but I know it's PG. <laughs> <laughs> we are back. Whoop, whoop. I never actually showed you properly what I was wearing. I can't show you here because it's quite... Oh, you can see. So, I'm wearing Stuart Weitzman boots, Zara skirt, mini skirt, ASOS top and um, Boohoo lace body. And then, oh, <laughs> I just bumped into the toilet. I'm not drunk, not junk. Oh my God, I need to just stop. And then my earrings are the same ones, H&M. And then my necklace is Topshop, but really old and so is my bangle Topshop as well. Uh, we are just going to, I might put, you don't have any comfy trousers, do you? Damn. I think I'll just put my slippers on. I'm gonna take my boots off and just wear my slides. But we're gonna go into another room now and just have a few bevies and continue the celebrations. Good morning, Ms. Ami. I can't tell if you can even see me or not, but me and Alex are up. We are going to, uh, Go and see my friend Kate. Or oh, she's gonna meet us in a second. She might you might even hear her knock on the door. And we're gonna go have our spa treatments. I'm having a fit for business back massage, like a full back exfoliation, cleanse, mask, and massage and lower leg massage. Alex is having like a scalp, neck, massage, and facial. And maybe something else? Anything else in there? No, I think that's it. These pillows are so comfortable, I'm stealing them because, I mean, it's a hotel. I'm sure they've got more somewhere because the first time in a long time I actually felt like I slept. Um, I've been having really bad insomnia, whereas last night, I mean, I didn't go to bed until 2 o'clock and we've woken up at 8, but I feel like I didn't, didn't even wake up. 
last night in, in the night, which I usually would do. Um, or I would struggle to get to sleep as well, whereas I, I feel like I nodded off relatively quickly and didn't wake up, so I'm definitely taking those pillows with me. But I'm sure it's also just being in the relaxing atmosphere. So yeah, we're gonna have some spa treatments, some breakfast, and then hop back into the pool and use the amenities. I'm just in the room, about to lie down and have my massage. Hi guys. These are all the really nice spa products hello <laughs> I've finished uh, my treatment now so I'm just trying to keep nice and quiet beautiful relaxing spa I feel I feel so good just so relaxed reconvened in the relaxation room with Kate just waiting for Alex Alex this couldn't have taken this long oh no <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm just gonna lie here for a bit before we head up for breakfast. <sighs> hey guys, we had breakfast and then we've just been chilling out in the room, but it's time to check out and then we're gonna have lunch. And I guess we're gonna head home after that um, to see what happens. I am terrible, I've forgotten to finish the vlog or vlog in general, but it was just a simple, lovely buffet lunch. Um, and then we traveled home and we were all like exhausted. So we were just battling against ourselves to not fall asleep in the car. Uh, me and Alex are just going to watch The Jungle Book on DVD and eat some KFC because you might as well just continue this relaxing weekend before work tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if otherwise I'll connect it to something else, but if this is the end, I bid you adieu. Thanks for watching guys. Bye!